Hey, 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 everybody. How you guys doing out there? This is Antonio one more time. Hope all, all of you are doing well out there. Today's recipe is an easy one. It's guacamole. Now that summertime is coming up, hopefully you get a chance to make this tasty dish. The ingredients. Let's get started. You're going to need about three medium-sized avocados, one onion, a small bunch of cilantro, one lemon. You're going to need garlic salt, regular salt, and uh, ground pepper. Okay. Now, the first thing you do is go ahead and uh, slice your avocados in half, take a spoon and wedge it between the skin and the actual flesh of the avocado and scoop them out into a bowl, just like you see there, okay? Looking good. Next, go ahead and take your lemon and squeeze the lemon, the juice of the whole lemon into the bowl there, okay? Next, take your onion and cut it and chop it up. You're gonna, you're gonna use about three quarters of the onion, not the whole onion. Uh, so there it is, finely chopped, and place that into the bowl with the avocados and the squeezed lemon. Um, very good. I didn't have any uh, uh, tortilla chips, so I decided to make my own in my little fryer there in the back in the patio. So I'll come back to those a little later. Now take your bunch of uh, cilantro, which of course have been, has been washed, and go ahead and dice it up finely, just like you see there. Okay, go ahead and place it into the... Uh, bowl Looking good now take your garlic salt and give it about four shakes of the garlic salt, but not too much more than that Next the same thing with the ground pepper give it about two shakes in there just for taste and Lastly regular salt about one or two shakes not too much more than that. You don't want it overly salty You can always add salt later go ahead and take your masher and uh, mash everything Together. If you don't have a masher, you can use two forks to, to mash the whole thing together until it becomes a creamy paste, just like you see there. Okay, I saved one of the pits of the avocado, and I went ahead and uh, threw it in there in the mixture. My understanding is that it keeps the, uh, the uh, guacamole real fresh. Okay? Don't need the pit. <laughs> okay, next, uh, I like uh, my food a little spicy, so I, I took two serrano peppers and slice them up in little circles like that. Now, my chips are finally ready there, and I went ahead and put them into a bowl. I shaked a little salt on them, and that will be the garnish for the guacamole. Okay, now you see the final product, the delicious creamy guacamole, uh, garnished with some of the uh, sliced serrano peppers, and served with the tortilla chips that I made. It's a real treat and it's real tasty. I hope you get a chance to make it. And as always, I do thank you for checking out my recipes, checking out my channel. Go ahead and leave a comment if you have one. And until the next one, take care. Bye-bye.